Okay, I used to live in an apartment. You know, like blasting this from the apartment during the eclipse. All right, today I'm taking out Iron Maiden. I'm listening to the song Total Eclipse. Let's get into it. Man, who was listening to this during the actual eclipse? This made me think you could literally have a total eclipse playlist. Probably. I don't know if there's many songs just like this, but like blasting this, like you live like, okay, I used to live in an apartment, you know, like blasting this from the apartment during the eclipse would have been funny. But then it also has me thinking based on some of the lyrics, like what were people thinking of eclipses back in the day? When I say back in the day, I mean like primitive time, you know, what I mean? like prehistoric time when there's an the eclipse because they were talking about the cries of fear or whatever when the sun is covered up something in the very beginning of the song. It's like, dang, yeah, back in the day, before technology, all this stuff, when there was a total eclipse, you probably thought something bad was happening. You probably worship in the sun, and then you're thinking you're getting cursed or something like that.
That was kind of a, you know, kind of a creepy ending. Like those sound effects are, well, it's not sound effects. They're actually playing music. For me, I would put it on my board as a sound effect. But you know what I mean? The ending, the music, kind <laughs> like that outro when they faded the music. That was kind of ominous. You know what I'm saying? That was kind of creepy. That has me thinking, what is the next song? You know what I mean? What is the next song on the album? Well, I guess the whole song was actually a little, you know, a little bit creepy. It seemed like a permanent eclipse or something. Like you're about to roll into some kind of ice age and all the people who are worshiping the sun are going to be SOL and terrified. And all that kind of stuff. And not like the Eclipse we just had the other day. This one seemed kind of permanent. In the second half of the song, like when they transitioned to the, uh, the guitar solo, what, what, was there a time signature change? Something, something was different. Like that transition just hit different. I felt like, oh, I'm vibing like, whoa, whoa, we're transit, whoa, whoa. You know what I mean? I felt like a little discombobulated during that transition. Either that or it felt like, I don't know. I don't know. It, it felt like uh, just a complete change of pace or vibe or something like that. That was crazy. I don't know. Tell me, man, what do you know? What do you know? Me and my boys on the road. Where to go? She told me, boy, you to go. Like I don't know.